Welcome to Liturgy of the Hours with Deacon Kevin. This is a ministry of St. Joseph's Catholic Church in Jacksonville, Florida. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth will proclaim your praise. Come, let us worship Christ, who holds the world and its wonders in his creating hand. Come, let us sing to the Lord and shout with joy to the rock who saves us. Let us approach him with praise and thanksgiving and sing joyful songs to the Lord. The Lord is God, the mighty God, the great King over all the gods. He holds in his hands the depths of the earth and the highest mountains as well. He made the sea, it belongs to him. The dry land too, for it was formed by his hands. Come then, let us bow down and worship, bending the knee before the Lord our Maker, for he is our God and we are his people. The flocky shepherds. Today listen to the voice of the Lord. Do not grow stubborn as your fathers did in the wilderness when at Mirabah and Massa they challenged me and provoked me, although they had seen all of my works. Forty years I endured that generation. I said, They are a people whose hearts go astray and they do not know my ways. So I swore in my anger, They shall not enter into my rest. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Come, let us worship Christ, who holds the world and its wonders in His creating hand. Praise my soul, the King of heaven. To His feet your tribute bring, ransom healed, restored, forgiven, Evermore his praises sing. Alleluia, alleluia. Praise the everlasting King. Praise him for his grace and favor to his children in distress. Praise him still the same as ever, slow to chide and swift to bless. Alleluia, alleluia. Glorious in his faithfulness. Father-like he tends and spares us well our feeble frame. He knows in his hand he gently bears us rescues us from all our foes alleluia alleluia widely yet his mercy flows angels help us to adore him you behold him face to face sun and moon bow down before him join the praises of our race alleluia alleluia praise with us the god of grace Dawn finds me ready to welcome you, my God. I call with all my heart, Lord, hear me. I will keep your statutes. I call upon you, save me, and I will do your will. I rise before dawn and cry for help. I hope in your word. My eyes watch through the night to ponder your promise. In your love, hear my voice, O Lord. Give me life by your decrees. Those who harm me unjustly draw near. They are far from your law. But you, O Lord, are close. Your commands are true. Long have I known that your will is established forever. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Save us by the power of your hand, Father, for our enemies have ignored your words. May the fire of your word consume our sins and its brightness illumine our hearts. Dawn finds me ready to welcome you, my God. The Lord is my strength and I shall sing his praise, for he has become my Savior. I will sing to the Lord, for he is gloriously triumphant. Horse and chariot he has cast into the sea. My strength and my courage is the Lord, and He has been my Savior. He is my God, I praise Him, the God of my Father. I extol Him. The Lord is a warrior. Lord is His name. Pharaoh's chariots and army He hurled into the sea. At a breath of your anger the waters piled up, and the flowing waters stood like a mound. The flood waters congealed in the midst of the sea. The enemy boasted 
I will pursue and overtake them. I will divide the spoils and have my fill of them. I will draw my sword. My hand shall despoil them. When your wind blew, the sea covered them. Like lead, they sank in the mighty waters. Who is like you among the gods, O Lord? Who is like to you, magnificent in holiness? O terrible in renown, worker of wonders, when you stretched out your right hand, the earth swallowed them. In your mercy you led the people you redeemed. In your strength you guided them to your holy dwelling. And you brought them in and planted them on the mountain of your inheritance, the place where you made a seat, O Lord, the sanctuary, O Lord, which your hands established. The Lord shall reign forever and ever. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Lord is my strength, and I shall sing his praise, for he has become my Savior. O oh, praise the Lord, all you nations. O oh, praise the Lord, all you nations. Acclaim him, all you peoples. Strong is his love for us. He is faithful forever. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. O oh, praise the Lord, all you nations. A reading from Song of Songs, chapter 8, verse 7. Deep waters cannot quench love, nor floods sweep it away. Were one to offer all he owns to purchase love, he would be roundly mocked. My heart is ever pleading, show me your face. My heart is ever pleading, show me your face. I long to gaze upon you, Lord, show me your face. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. My heart is ever pleading, show me your face. Now this wise virgin has gone to Christ. Among the choirs of virgins, she is radiant as the sun in the heavens. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets, he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham, to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, and holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High. For you will go before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us, to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death, and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Now this wise virgin has gone to Christ. Among the choirs of virgins, she is radiant as the sun in the heavens. Christ is the spouse and crowning glory of virgins. Let us praise him with joy in our voices and pray to him with sincerity in our hearts. Jesus, crown of virgins, hear us. Christ, the holy virgins, loved you as their one true spouse. Grant that nothing may separate us from your love. You crowned Mary, your mother, queen of virgins. Through her intercession, let us continually serve you with pure hearts. Your handmaids were always careful to love you with whole and undivided attention, that they may be holy in body and spirit. Through their intercession, Grant that the lure of this world may not distract our attention from you. Lord Jesus, you are the spouse whose coming was anticipated by the wise virgins. Grant that we may wait for you in hope and expectation. 
through the intercession of today's saint, who was one of the wise and prudent virgins, grant us wisdom and innocence of life. Now let us pray as the Lord has taught us to pray. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Lord, as we recall the memory of St. Scholastica, we ask that by her example we may serve you with love and obtain perfect joy. Grant this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. The Lord be with you and with your Spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace. Thanks be to God.